Uh, so I'm here in Elephant and Castle Shopping Centre, which is slated for redevelopment, and it's packed full of businesses, small businesses, quite a lot of Latin American businesses, and they all have a really uncertain future. And I think it's really important that the next Mayor of London, hopefully that's me, um, can put together a London plan that actually protects businesses in redevelopment, make sure that they have space to move back into, and make sure they can move into them at affordable rent. We have to be protecting these businesses because they provide half of London's jobs and they're about 99% of London's businesses. Hello. The only thing I know is we have to leave the shopping center and I have to go but I don't know what happened, I don't know what they say soon, I don't know at all. And how long have you been here? 15 years. 15 years? Yes. I'm Sean, I'm Green candidate for Mayor. Um, we're here launching our policies for smaller businesses okay. and talking about how we want to protect people when things are regenerated, give businesses like yours the right to return at the same rents. How secure are you in having this space and, and I've getting been it back? here a long time, nearly 18 years. 18 years. Okay. Sadly, we have to move from here for business because I a long time business. Then after that, I 55, very difficult to find a job, isn't it? Mm. Then so, what can we do? A mixture of different shops is really important to every single area. We need spaces maybe for bigger shops with more goods. We also need lots of little spaces like the little repair shop for clothes that we just visited, uh, the little Thai food place, all these market stalls that are outside. That can be forgotten when you've just got an architect's plan and everything's all shiny and you want to do big deals with big companies. Actually what makes London great is the individuality of its different neighbourhoods. This is unusual in that there's one business occupying this office. Much more typical is a couple of doors down. Oh my goodness, you're right, there's millions of businesses in here. This is the point, you know, wow. they're tiny little spaces. Well, there's more than 70 Latin American businesses in this area now, and it's becoming a real hub for people to come to, for culture, and another part of my policies is going to be trying to protect that emerging heritage, those emerging traditions, uh, to make sure that we don't just turn all of London into homogenous chain stores and things. It's about independent businesses and a resilient economy, but also preserving the character of areas that have grown up sort of organically um, and protecting them in the future.